everybody. I want you to meet this wonderful woman, this wonderful woman who I always say, look at you, Ashley Lisk. She is known as being one of the best bartenders around. That's how we met her at night. Mm -hmm. But more importantly, she's known as having one of the biggest hearts around, too. She cares about people. She loves children. And that's why you came up with your organization. Mm -hmm. Toys for Young Sound Kids. Yes, and you came up with it, what, three, four years ago? This is four years now, and this will be our fifth Christmas. And how did you, what made you decide to do this? My daughter and I were going through a lot, and we lost her best friend in a tragic accident, and we were experienced a lot of struggles. So when we finally had things panning out and looking up, we offered to get Thanksgiving dinners for people. Mm -hmm. um, we delivered 87 to front doorsteps, and then wow. we got a phone call, hey, can you help with Christmas? Can you help with Christmas? And then that turned into a few more people saying, can you help with Christmas? Yes. And now these, what did you say, four years later? Yep. This will be our fifth Christmas last year. Our biggest number yet was 265 families, or 265 kids. 265, yeah. okay. So that meant on Black Friday, she had to do a lot of shopping. Show us what you have here a little bit, Ashley. A little bit is still left in the unit. We have two units that we use. One is to shop from to get the children's items that they ask for. This is what's still to be picked from for the children still coming in. We have everything from boys' toys and girls' toys and clothing and bedding and shoes and arts and crafts and household items for when people wow. have emergencies. Wow, wonderful. I think that the way she delivers the toys is fantastic, too. She has a party. Um, I, I had the honor of helping her the, the very first year. She has a party and the kids come and they meet Santa. And while they're meeting Santa, their parents are whisked off to the other room and they pick up the bag that's designated for them. Yes. After the parents actually submit a list to you of what they need yes. for the kids. And they're actually great because the kids write the letters themselves to Santa. They don't realize that we're helping them. So it goes to Santa's substation, which gets delivered to us. And we help from there. And this book here, this is how Ashley knows what each child needs. And this is certainly a tearjerker, this book. But you said no crying. It can be, but That's no the crying. Rule. That's the rule. My daughter okay. would yell, and yes. she goes, people get sad. No, no, no. No, we got to stay happy. This yeah. is all a good thing, a yes. positive thing. This one letter, there, there's a few of them that really touched your heart, though. Yes. This one right here in particular. This is great. Jersey, as she is one of five, everybody says, I've been good. I want, I want. Jersey explains, my name is Jersey. I love you. I got cookies, so come see me. And that's her picture of cookies. <laughs> that's her so. cookie that she drew for Santa to know. So she's offering up something in return. She's not even asking for anything. She's yeah. just offering him, hey, oh, I have cookies. Oh, that's wonderful. And then this one, Dear Santa, I've been, I've been good, good this year. year. I'm not going to ask for much. Um, because they know it's not to ask for much, mm -hmm. but you did you find out exactly what they do need. Yes, because we have the children write the specific letters themselves. If they're not old enough to write, somebody can write for them. They just have to draw a picture or do a handprint or something oh, so we know. Wow. And this is how the packages end up when they when they go to the kids. They are all uh, boxed up, and of course, it takes some volunteers to do some of that work. And uh, Lisa here is a volunteer, and she's so excited to be helping Ashley out because she benefited from from Ashley's kindness and all of Ashley's work. Lisa, tell us about your situation. Um, in 2015, my son was diagnosed with leukemia. Um, I seen on Facebook that a post stated. Um, if you need help with assistance for Christmas, please have your children write a letter to Santa Claus and perhaps get picked by a donor. Um, we had no idea that um, my kids were picked until Ashley reached out to me oh. and, and told me um, your kids were one of the kids that were sponsored. And um, from 2015, with her help, it just opened my heart more. Um, someone helping me in my time of need. It gave you Christmas when you might have yes. not had Christmas yes. at a time I, when you so needed it because yes. you found out your son was so sick. Yes. Yes. So wonderful. Wonderful. Really, really an example of, of all the work that she does paying off and then giving you a chance to, to give back to. Okay, so of course, Ashley's got plenty of toys you can see here, but she needs so much more. She's getting more and more requests, emergency cases, she says. Um, so if people want to give and you so need them to give and keep this going, how do they do that? They can go to our Facebook page under Toys for Youngstown Kids. They can look our website up, which is www.toysforyoungstownkids.weebly.com. Um, they can bring in items to Uncle, but well, now, 
Life Storage in Austin Town, Inner Circle Pizza in Campfield, uh, Life Storage in Boardman, and several other places. Okay, wonderful. In the end, Ashley, and this, each year when it all wraps up and you watch the last of the toys go away, what do you think? How do you feel? It really warms my heart, and it's made my daughter who it, it gets me to know that she's going to be the most loving, caring individual ever. And it warms my heart to see all these kids that have nothing, get something and a smile. And I get cases that where I become close with families, I get pictures of the kids on Christmas opening gifts, and I mean, it, it's, it's a great feeling. So, so much reward and satisfaction. Yes. And work. She works all year long on this, and she even dives into her own savings sometimes when it gets uh, that thin. So. Yeah. So look at you, Ashley Liss, making such a huge difference for so many families year after year. And of course, you can help her out, and we sure hope you do. Make it a great day.